Happy Vlogmas today, guys. I, what am I doing today? Today I have some errands to do. I'm looking a little raw right now. So I'm gonna go grab some tea really quickly, finish getting myself together, and I have to go to therapy today. Some more of these ornaments that I found in the Dollar Tree. So I wanna go get these ornaments. And don't mind my room. I have to get this room together. I thought I was going to decorate in here for the holiday, but I don't know if the glam suite is going to get a makeover. I don't know. I have so many other things to do. And I have two videos that I want to shoot today. So let's get started. So now I'm going to attempt to try to do something to this crazy face of mine. <clears throat> Oh, and this, what I just put on my face is a face primer by Sonia. How do you say Cash? I can never say this last name of this product. <laughs> uh, you can find this like at Target. <clears throat> so I'm just kind of put that little bit of base. Something really quick, quick little beat. So another one of my favorites, which is a black opal. Gonna give a cute little squirt. Give her all over. So one of my errands today is going to do something with these nails. I have several things I need to do and I don't want to keep worrying about these nails. So I'm gonna go get, cause this is like regular polish. I'm gonna go get some gel nails. So give me that longevity of not chipping. So I've really kind of just started getting it done. Like I've always been a girly girl, but never been into like getting the whole nails done for some reason. Like I don't really like the acrylic. I don't really like what that does. To my nails, kind of beats it up a little bit. So I kind of just stopped really getting it done. I've just been bare nails for a while. And my friend, um, Tam, always be like, girl, get your nails done. And I was just like, okay, honey. Like, she's just like, you gotta get your nails done. She's a manicure, so of course, when that's your profession, you know, you're very passionate about it. And I'm cool with it because guess what? She pretty much inspired me to do and get my nails done. And be a little lady around my nails. So, give me eyebrows. A little touch up. So what do you guys have planned for this holiday season? I like to hear what you guys are doing. Um, Christmas is really big for me. Like, I love it. Even though my kids are getting big. This is my last year. Um, my girls will be home for the holidays of high school next year. They'll be in college, so they'll be coming home for Christmas. I've already experienced this with my son going away to school and coming home for the holidays. It's kind of bittersweet, you know, the same little traditions that we used to do when they were younger. It's just like, you know, as they get older, you just have to revamp things, you know, create new traditions. And that's what the girls and I were talking about. You know, just creating 
new traditions. Uh, like just in the past three years, we've been doing um like a family Christmas party. I mean, not what I'm trying to say. Of course, it's a Christmas party. We've been doing a pajama party, and it kind of just started on a whim, really, guys. And like. This is our third year. I'm pretty excited. So the family is kind of excited um, to be coming over again. And this year, it's kind of more of a theme. Like last time, we're just like, oh, okay, wear your pajamas. You know, everybody came over in their little cute pajamas. My nephews are so adorable in their pajamas. I have all nephews. Um, for some reason, I only have one niece and don't have a baby niece. My niece is, what is she? She's 14. Wow. My niece is 14. So I don't have any little girly girls. Um, don't have any grandkids. I'm not ready for that one. <laughs> At all. Just a little quick shadow on here. This is kind of like my little traveling um mascara <laughs> but i kind of just love it because i love the brush it gets kind of gets like into the lashes pretty good so just the kids coming over um kind of brings back the little nostalgic of my kids being little just having my nephews over uh running around and their little cute little pjs so I'm definitely looking forward to it. Um, and this year, the theme is uh, like a lumberjack theme. So everybody is coming over in their lumberjack, black, white type theme. Sorry, I was over there looking in this mirror. I'm trying to put this mascara on. So everyone has to come dressed in like a little the buffalo check theme. Yeah. Everybody's going to be in that attire. And uh, we have games. We laugh. And, oh, other outside of the, the, the theme, um, as far as the color-wise, we haven't. We're having, the theme is PK, I can't talk, PJs and pancakes. So, it's going to be brunchy. Normally, I don't do heavy foods for these things. Um, they're usually um, just light, uh, like, I don't want to say, like finger foods. That's what I'm trying to say. I usually do, like, finger foods for um, the party. Because, you know, the following week, like, we're having Christmas dinner. We're having the heavy foods again. So, I like to keep it light. Uh, we usually do, like, sliders. Um, we'll do, um, I always make these little mac and cheese balls. They, they go really well. Like, <laughs> they love those. Um, I also do the cocoa bar. Um, so the cocoa station, the marshmallows, the boys just go crazy <laughs> over that. And, um, so like I said, just keeping it small, um, bite-sized stuff. So this year, it's going to be a twist. It's going to be brunch, but it's still going to keep that little miniature theme so we're gonna have like little mini waffles probably chicken and waffles also we will do uh pancakes some mini pancakes i know some of you guys probably seen that i always share those on my instagram um we're gonna have french toast um probably little breakfast sliders as well home fries mimosa uh probably like apple cider you name it. Um, all those things that we have for brunch. Brunchy breakfast stuff. So, um, in the days to come, too, like, I'll be preparing for that. So, I'll just be taking you guys on a journey with that, too. So, that's kind of going to be some of the gist of what we're going to have for the the brunch and this year we also add a little twist too like everyone I had everyone bring um 
this essay keep it simple not a lot just to bring uh gifts little little small gifts um like totaling 25 dollars i'm gonna just bring some gifts for like um the kids you could bring some gifts i mean for the yeah for for the little boys um and then some little fun stuff for adults it's like little fun trinkety kind of gifts not spending a lot but just something fun um that we could open up we could laugh kind of like little little gag gifts some little cozy socks things like that so that's going to be a different little twist to the brunch this year look at the pjs oh and then we also have a uh we have a fashion show with the PJs. So everybody models their PJs. And then the boys. <laughs> the boys get a little funny with their PJs and dancing all over. <clears throat> so but I'll I'll definitely share and keep you guys abreast with that. I think we're pretty simple. We don't need a whole lot. Just enough to wake this crazy little face up. So, just a little quick, little, quick, 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 quick little beat. So, my next move, guys, is going to be um, the nail salon. So, I'll meet you there. Bye. Today is absolutely fabulous outside for the end of November. But you know what? We've been experiencing this type of weather in the past couple couple years but i'm enjoying it i'm loving it being on the east coast and still being able to jo enjoy some 60 degree weather like today is literally like 60 degrees like having this little like no sweater today <laughs> i really don't need a sweater today so all you guys who have live on the east or well, live on the east coast i know you guys are enjoying this as well i know the west coast you guys are used to this really nice weather so i'm gonna appreciate every bit of it <laughs> so they say we gotta pull out the winter coats so my first stop as i share with you guys Aries will be. The nail salon, like where I go to, is not far from my house. I'm literally like walking here, and like where I'm going is in the city, so I'll be catching a train into the city to go finish up some of my errands. back again and today was a productive day I got a lot done um, as you can see I finally have this guy all done and what today was another follow well, well what I did today was go pick up some more things that I needed to fill in this big guy with some new things because of the theme that I'm doing is a little um, different. You can see it's a little. I'm gonna go with a cozy cottage kind of feeling. Um, so you know how you just add a little glam to it. That, that's my usual thing. I always do the glam thing. So I just said, you know what? How about I just call it my glamping um, theme? <laughs> a little different. Um, so you still may see a little bit of sparkly going on. Um, but it's more of a cozy glamping cabin feel. So that's what um, 
this holiday theme is all about um, more natural, something totally out of my element. Kind of going up the steps with the um, pieces of wood and the um, acorns, all that good stuff. I barely use that stuff. I used to do it like years ago, but you know, I kind of saw that theme and got a little excited about it. So I'm a little excited to share um, the theme into like what I was telling you guys earlier, which is our um, holiday pajama party. So I'm talking, talking, talking. I'm going to close out this vlog and I will see you guys tomorrow for Vlogmas. I'm totally excited about this. This is um, my first time doing this, so I'm excited to share this journey with you guys during this Vlogmas. So, bye lovelies.